Hey, it's Tom Gallagher, the video Videopreneur, and today we're at Bill Thomas Camper in Wentzville, Missouri, and we're shooting a 2023 Ember Touring Edition. I had to open this hatch before I shot here. It takes two hands to open the damn thing. As you can see, it's got two handles, which is great for security, but when you're trying to hold the camera and it's cold out and you're trying to open up a hatch that has two handles, it's not the easiest to do. So this is a 2023 Ember 26 RB. And here is the outside kitchen. Really a nice RV, nice griddle, dormitory style and size refrigerator. Here are the sensors and I'll show you the front sensor. So that notifies you of a vehicle in your blind spot. Ember does an outstanding job. I do wish they had a cover for their spare tire. They do an outstanding job, but one of my pet peeves is having the spare tire covered. The UV rays play hell on the sidewalls and you don't know it's a compromised tire until it's too late. There's that Ember cut into the uh, structure up there so here you'll see what i'm talking about i'm gonna have to jostle the camera so it takes two hands to open these doors your pass-through storage here's your water station here are the two locks here's the uh, sensor i was talking about so this tells you if there's a vehicle in your blind spot and then it lights this light up. So when you look in your mirror as you're driving, it will let you know if a vehicle is in your blind spot. And if you've pulled a trailer before, you know how valuable that is because when you're trying to change lanes, there's always some inconsiderate knucklehead that's uh, not ready to let you over. So here is the uh, badging, uh, Ember 26RB. Let's get inside where it's out of the wind and a little warmer. It's cold outside. It's cold in here. Another nice feature of the Ember is you have a safe on board, which is really a nice feature. And wide open spaces on the inside here. I really like the way the uh, ember is built. Let me turn off my light here so you can see. So they put lighting behind the mirrors, then there's lighting in the ceiling. But that exit lighting in the mirrors of your medicine cabinet really are nice. And then they put these very small magnets, but very strong strong magnets as you can see they are really a, a strong magnet but plenty of storage now this is the outside storage is down here as you saw or the outside kitchen so you don't have the full storage there's the screen and then you have your privacy screen on the bottom european style windows so they're insulated windows you have your theater seating with your center console the windows are European style. They are insulated. And then you have the pull down screen and then the privacy screen. I'm not even going to try and work that. In the summer, it can be a pain. In the winter, when your hands are cold, it's, it's stupid. So flat screen TV, fireplace. I really like this underneath. If you've got cookie sheets or pizza trays and you're gonna make a pizza in your oven, you're gonna need that storage above and below and three burner cooktop, microwave oven. Here's a lock for your refrigerator and your freezer. Amber came on the scene and just right out of the chute made an amazing RV and they've just 
improved upon that. So every year they just make a nicer unit. I told you it was cold outside. How's that? 36 degrees inside. So your fingers get, uh, your digits get pretty damn cold. So you have nice size storage on the left and right of the bed. I'll turn on my light again. Little storage behind, <coughs> behind place to put your uh, CPAP or your cell phone. I love the, I think it's called a moonlight, moonlight or starlight. You could also call it a skylight, but European insulated. But that way you can lay in bed and look at the stars. We have under bed storage. Let me hit the light here again. Under bed storage. Nicely done. This is your second door. And then you have a cabinet. And then you have a storage here as well. Now that, that cabinet is into your kitchen so it is somewhat restricted but you have full length drawers and then also your outdoor or your second door to the outside here's a place to put a flat screen tv should you want one should you need one what are your thoughts on the floor do you prefer to see the flooring running east west north south or do you like this uh, i think it's called herringbone do you prefer the herringbone or do you prefer the uh, flooring running in one direction? I prefer to have it running in one direction. I've never really liked the herringbone personally. But this is the 2023 Ember 26 RB. Love to hear your comments. If you enjoyed the video, got value, give it a thumbs up and I'll catch you on the next video. Thanks again for watching. Appreciate your support.